Good morning, y'all. I am making my daily smoothie right now. And then I'm gonna head over to this cafe. I'm excited to show you guys. I just got to this cafe about like two weeks ago and I've just been trying to get out of the house. I haven't left the house at all yesterday and I think it's time to leave. But it's Friday, yay. I don't have anything planned this week at all. I don't really want to go out. This is actually my first week end alone because I stopped seeing someone it ended and I was literally spending every weekend with him. So yeah. It's kind of weird to say, but I didn't think that that relationship was going to affect me as much as it is right now. And I just, I think I just literally need to leave my house um, and get over it, you know? I would say, I don't think it was anything like really too crazy. I think we were just trying to see like, like where things would We go out and it didn't happen. And I think I just tried to fight hard for him and he just wasn't ready. Well, I think that's the reason why. Mm. Plus it's Valentine's Day this upcoming weekend. And I was really excited for it because this is my, my fourth year alone on Valentine's Day. But love ain't for everybody. And love is blind, y'all. It is so nice out. It's like 60 degrees and it's middle of February. I am heading over to this cafe that I found about two weeks ago. day for the last week i'm eating with hummus cilantro tofu cheese pepper shrimp he's a uh Chicken is first or the egg is first? But I said, what time do you wake up? No, it's not the time. The, when you, the most, most time people eat the, fr the egg fry morning time, right? Then mo the egg is the first. If you eat the chicken night, then, then chicken is the first. That's what it is. You don't understand? No, I don't understand. Oh, that's a, that's a philosophy, girl. Philosophy. Mm. Anyway, Crystal, Crystal, what's up? No, I just, I, I want to ask you, do you work to live or you live to work? That's what I'm saying. If you want to eat, you got to work, right? Yeah. You want to work, you have to eat. Do you understand? Yeah, I understand. Mm. What if... So, there is no which one is first. Because you want to keep working, you like to work, you got to eat. You want to eat, you're hungry, you have to work. You know what I'm saying? So, which means uh, to eat, work, nothing. There is a nothing. What What about someone who doesn't want both? Die. They die? Yeah. Physically die or the, the psychologically die? Which one you think will come first? Nothing come first. It's the same. Okay. Yeah, you're right. If you don't work or eat, you die. Yes, but everybody ended up to die sooner or later, right? Yeah. But during the, our the lifetime, we have to make the money in order to live convenient, you know? I hope so. Otherwise, uh, we don't need to work. Yeah, if uh, no, no mother, father, you have nothing to work, no physically help, uh, supporting, then uh, you die. Yeah. 
No choice. That's why you have to work in order to build up the, your physical the foundation. And uh, when the, your physical foundation is good, then the, your mentality is getting stronger. And uh, you could able to do something that you want to do it for your lifetime. You know? Yeah, you're right. Mm. That's what it is, girl. That's what it is. I swear my dad is a genius. He should just write himself a book. Every time I call him because I'm feeling like crap and I keep living in my limiting beliefs, I just, I don't know y'all. There's a lot of thoughts that's been coming in my head right now, but it's a Saturday and I'm just really excited to just edit. I've been editing this one video. It's really freaking long, but I think it's really informative and valuable. So I hope you guys, I like that video um i look crazy right now but i asked my dad i was like you live to work or you work to live and he goes what came first the chicken or the egg and i'm like oh my god this man he's like a genius so he was just trying to explain to me like if you want to eat you gotta work but if you're working you gotta eat so it's like oh, this man is so smart but anyways, I am running obviously really late again and I just missed my bus. Nicole just came from California and I haven't seen her in two years. However, I'm very excited to go see her. We're gonna shoot some city stuff, some brands in New York City. Haven't done that in a while. Actually, I actually haven't shot on a camera in a very long time, like photo stuff. So I'm close my laptop and we are about to go out. <laughs> Okay guys, this is Nicole. She flew Hi. thousands of miles away to see me. I do. Okay, well maybe not exactly for me, but she did. <laughs> it's just for you, don't worry. Yay. All right, so we're out here in Tribeca and we're gonna go shoot this clothing brand for Nicole. Hello. It is where we got these it's jackets Alice from. <laughs> no, honestly, it's like the most comfortable clothing, athleisure clothing I own, but we're gonna be shooting here this bridge we've been trying to find this bridge for a while but shout out to eric and declan for giving us the spots mainly eric though yeah um also can you confirm with me that new jersey is the sixth borough <laughs> <laughs> Just finished shooting for Alice the Kitty, cream, aka Nicole's wardrobe. <laughs> <laughs> but I get questions on this all the time. But if you guys want, I'll add Nicole's code. Code. <laughs> I'll add her code below. Okay. So after this, where are we going? Uh, Brooklyn Bridge Park. Brooklyn Bridge. Time. Yeah. I just got over to Brooklyn Bridge Park, but oh my gosh, they're doing construction in the middle. I haven't been here in so long. This is new. Oh my god. All right, I am looking for Nicole. I have her location on, and I don't think she knows that I'm here yet. <laughs> but I made her way another like two hours. Sorry, I love you. I think I see her. I think I see her. I don't see her. I don't see her. Okay, should I scream her name? Oh my god, okay, here she is. Hi! This is Santiago. Hi, how are you? Santiago, nice to meet you. Nicole's gonna style me right now. Basically. 
the shot. She was like there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that does not well. <laughs> Okay. Alright. Um, bucket hat. Bucket hat. It's tiny. Yeah, I have a big ass head. head. <laughs> okay, wait. Dude, I have a big ass head. Oh my god, that was too small. Does it fit you? Because if it fits you, it does. <laughs> my head's just really big. Okay, it's okay. We can Photoshop it. I have a big head. Does it fit now? But I feel like it would look better with black. Yeah, I think so. Maybe you should wear it. I'll take a photo. Um. <laughs> So there is a crazy sunset burn over there. It is the wrong side of the time of the year where it usually sets right by the Freedom Tower. But um, we're just gonna go shoot. We're gonna shoot until I got here so late, so it's gonna be dark really fast. By the way, this is Santiago. I just met him. Hello. Nicole. <laughs> Obviously, she's leaving tomorrow. So we were supposed to go to Canada tomorrow, but that ended up not happening, or it's not gonna happen, so. <laughs> Wait, go back that way. <laughs> Hello. <Hi. laughs> Ha, 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 ha.